So the big shots, the experts who know all about this, they tell us very confidently that we cannot criminalize poverty. That's why we have to start putting, getting these people out of jail, putting them back on the streets. They can go back to their families, their homes, their jobs, and lead productive lives. And then when they come to trial, we'll slap them on the wrist and they'll see the error of their ways. They say that. That's one of the reasons this guy is out on the street after six months ago. He held a woman in a house with a gun and a hostage, said he was going to kill her. He was going to kill any cops that came in. Well, they, they figured out how to get him out of the house, and he figured out how to be back on the street so he could shoot a cop just minutes before this, this, this scene went down. Get down on the ground for me. Get down on the ground for me. Straight up. Everybody hush. Get down on the ground. Straight up. Put your hands out to your side. Keep them there. Keep them there. Hands out to your side. And of course, as soon as the cops had him handcuffed and they stood him up, what's the first thing he said? He went into the whole black victimization routine. You guys are trying to kill me. Please, sir. I want some more. The cops don't like doing that. That makes the black kids angry. 